As the second largest marine turtle, loggerheads, coretta coretta, are oceanic dwellers and can be found within most of the major water bodies around the planet. They can cover huge distances whilst in the ocean currents, and research suggests that they use them in a similar way to the film Finding Nemo. In spite of this huge habitat, their status is set as vulnerable by the IUCN for a number of reasons. Loggerheads can take over 20 years before they become sexually mature. They are very slow to reproduce also, as once they have laid around four clutches of eggs, loggerheads take a break of between three to four years before they become sexually active again. This, added to the fact that they rely on a high fecundity, low survival rate, means populations can take a long time to recover. Like all turtles, loggerheads return to beaches to lay their eggs from May until around August. The arduous crawl up the beach is very energy intensive and once the correct spot has been identified, they dig deep before the nest is ready. Each clutch contains around 100 eggs. A lesser known fact is that the eggs within each clutch are fertilized from multiple fathers and this might be one of the keys to their success by ensuring genetic diversity. Loggerheads, as with many reptiles, have temperature dependent sex determination with males being born if the average nest temperature is below 28 degrees and females born if above 31. Typically, female digs just enough for the nest to span both temperature ranges, which ensures both sexes are born. This dependence on temperature makes all turtle species vulnerable to the effects of climate change and demonstrates why humans need to intervene in the manner seen in this clip.